हेलो एवरी वन टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन द क्रोमोजोमल थियरी ऑफ सेक्स डिटर्मिनेशन इट इज सेकेंड इयर जुआलॉजी जेनेटिक्स यूनिट इट इज वन ऑफ द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट लांग आंसर क्वेश्चन इन द आईपीई डिस्क्राइब द क्रोमोजोमल थियरी ऑफ सेक्स डिटर्मिनेशन दट इज द क्वेश्चन सो हियर जनरली द सेक्स डिटर्मिनेशन इज बाय द हेटिरो गैमेटिक सेक्सेस हेटिरो मीन्स टू डिफरेंट सो फॉर एग्जाम्पल एक्स एक्स दीज आर टू सिमिलर एक्स वाई डिसिमिलर दट इज वाई दिस इज होमो हेटिरो मीन्स डिफर एक्स वाई डिफर सो हिअर वेदर इट इज मेल और फीमेल द हेटिरो गैमेटिक कंडीशन विल डिसाइड द सेक्स ऑफ द हाफ स्प्रिंग दट इज द कॉन्सेप्ट वेदर इट इज मेल और फीमेल इन मेल वी हैव अ हेटिरो that will decide the sex of the half spring if in female having the dissimilar gametes then female also will decide the sex of the organism so here male or female is not a parameter the heterogametic sexes that is the parameter to determine the sex of the half spring so in that so here what is homogametic heterogametic then at the time of fertilization the sex of the half spring will be decided and we have a autosomes and allosomes allosomes means a pair of chromosomes that are responsible for the sex of the half springs that are called allosomes or sex chromosomes that is example in human xy it is also heterogametic so here we have a two type of chromosomal methods male heterogametic method female heterogametic method name itself indicate male heterogametic means here male will produce two different type of gametic karyotype so here hetero condition in male that is why here male is determine the sex of the half spring here male only responsible of the sex of the half spring then here again two types xx xo type xx xy type in xx xo type it is seen in three type of organisms bed bug cockroach grasshopper so you have to remember like a vaccine bcg bed bug b c cockroach g grasshopper so why means this is very much important in the mcq for mset and neat they may ask they given the example and the karyotypes or it is male or female heterogametic so you have to remember the karyotype and which type of heterogametic and which type of organisms so xx xo type seen in the bcg and also here it is homogametic females are homogametic having two x chromosomes then male having heterogametic having only one x chromosome hetero one is x one is zero means there is no another pairing of chromosomes so here heterogametic condition in male na so male will decide the sex so here in the female homogametic if the male or having hetero so if the x chromosome is paired with the x of the female it is female organism then the remaining half of the a complement is paired with the another x of the female it is the karyotype xo it is treated as a male so here the male heterogametic condition will decide the sex of the half spring so here the sperm have 50% of x chromosomes 50% of only a complement means there is no another y chromosome here all ova contain same x chromosome that is why homogametic so this is xxxo xxxy it is seen in seen in the hd human and drosophila female having same two x chromosomes homo male having heterogametic 50% or x chromosomes 50% of y chromosomes then here male only will decide the sex of the organ organisms then female heterogametic name itself indicate in the female there is no homogametic heterogametic condition two dissimilar and different gametes are produced by the female 
then female only responsible or determine the sex of the half spring so here female produce two types of ova male produces only one type of sperm that is why male homogametic female two different types na heterogametic that is why females are responsible to determine the sex of the organism then so female heterogametic sex determined by the ovum then here two types z o z z z w z z so remember homo same male hetero female hetero female homo male so whatever the alphabets you have to remember homo male hetero female that is why female heterogametic so here remember fb just like a facebook femia butterfly important for mcqs male having homogametic and two type of z chromosomes female having hetero only one z chromosome so while here the heterogametic condition of the ova will decide the sex of the half spring same likewise here z w z z it is in a brf birds reptiles and fishes it is seen in the birds reptile fishes brf code here same again male homogametic with two z chromosomes female with hetero 50% of z chromosomes 50% of w chromosome so here z w will decide the sex of the half spring for example from ova we have a 50% z 50% w z with sperm z it is considered as a male w ova will pair with the z sperm it is female so at the end you have to remember in the male or female we have to concentrate the heterogametic sperm or ova heterogametic or dissimilar sexes will decide the sex of the half spring whether it is male or female for example in male we have a xxxo type xxxy type xxxo bcg xxxy hd female zo zz fb zw zz brf so just very simple you have to remember the karyotype and the examples male female you have to remember this chart you can write easily to the long question and also you can do the mcqs for mcet and neat thank you if you like the video please share and subscribe